Hey everybody, XCI here for another Let's Watch Trailers. I'm going to be watching all of the trailers for the Uncharted series, 1 through 4. I got one video up where, where uh, a fine user put all of these together, uh, so I don't have to go searching for a bunch of uh, videos. Hopefully these are all the good ones. These are all the cinematic trailers. That's all I'm going to watch. I'm not, I know there's DLCs and stuff too. Um, I did quickly look up the wiki page just to kind of have some understanding of when things came out and whatnot. Uh, and my God, my God, 2007? Uh, Uncharted 1 came out in 2007 oh my god so I was talking about Last of Us being kind of one of those like top list games that I want to play as soon as I start playing PlayStation games uh, on this channel but my god if the, if Uncharted 1 came out in 2007 Uncharted 2 came out in 2009 Uncharted 2, 3 came out in 2011 all three of those games came out before the Last of Us launch so I was sent the Uncharted Nathan Drake collection for the PS4 uh, this got released in 2015, and then Part 4 got released in 2016. I hope I remembered all those dates correctly. I think I did. Uh, but then the, the next fascinating thing I saw is just how much money these games made. Oh my god. Let me see if I can remember all of these ones. $4 million for the first game. $6 million. <laughs> say that with like man what one of them is seven one of them is six i think it was like seven million for the second one six point something million for the third one eight point seven million for number four? Oh my god but the other stats that completely floored me were the sales numbers i had no idea i mean i knew these games were big but not this big i'm gonna see if i can remember all these numbers i should have just put them up on my screen somewhere but something like 2.6 million copies sold for the first game why, why do I challenge my memory like this? This is it's absurd. I could literally just look this up. But no, I am going to challenge my memory. 2.6 million first copies sold. I, I had like this math thing and then I'm like, and then plus 10. So then 13 million sold in uh, for the second game. And then I went plus five. 17 sold. Yes, I work in patterns. That's how it works. Okay. 17 million sold for three and then at 11. Uh, and then 28 million copies sold for number four. That's a crazy amount of money that this game made. So, of course, this franchise is still going. Uh, so, anyways, that's uh, that's enough of an intro. My God, I derailed big time there. Uh, so, here's the four videos back to back. back. This is an eight-minute min video with all of them put together. A little loud. We're on the trail of the lost treasure of El Dorado, and it's brought us here. Yeah, I kind of got that sense. In the middle of the Pacific Ocean. God, when did the money? When did the mummy come out? Because I felt like there was sort of a theme going on ten years ago. Where? Okay, looks a little more aged for sure. Is this the one I watched? That looked familiar to that. That I feel like that this might might have been the one I watched. Still looks good, but it definitely. Yeah, this is the one I, I saw. Unless that mechanics in all the games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This definitely looks like a 2007 or. Hey, man, but the bases still look pretty good for 2007. But then again, Mass Effect look decent. The faces look. And I just might let you live. Nah, it looks about similar to. Mass Effect 2007. Okay, just cut off a, a lot of good eyebrow motions in the facial animations. I don't know, it's the simple things, it's weird. Okay, so it's an action shooter. It's, 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 it's so cool. not cool. How much trouble could one girl be? Ah. Yeah, you can tell with the color too, it's just Oh, I like the the that's either gonna mean that we're gonna really love those mechanics or, or dread them. <laughs> now I'm not gonna. I looked at the reviews too. I'm not gonna remember those numbers, but they were all very good. But the first one I think was the worst of them. I think this was the best one. It was like high 90s. Oh, is this the train? Oh, so this is the one I might have. What? Does he have to do some, is there like some crazy quick time? Is that what the, I always forgot. I was talking about this in our last video. Yeah, okay, this is the one. Some quick time action stuff you gotta do. I've got a job for us. I don't remember Clark snow though. I don't remember snow. Part with a huge sum of cash if we acquire a certain object. 
We are gonna snatch that treasure right out from under. None of this looks familiar. What could possibly? No, I don't remember a city. No crap! Oh. <laughs> So 2009. So it still feels 2009-ish. Dollar for Marco I would. Polo's journals. He's been after the Chintamani stone feet. Oh, I know who He's that is. Competing with a psychopathic, Claudia of Black. Psychological gemstone. When you put it that way, it does sound pretty stupid. What do you say we really? really that totally looks like Nathan Fillion. Do it. I know that was a thing back back during Firefly days and stuff like that too. I don't think he. I don't think he's the voice, though, right? He's not the voice. I know where the stone is. You better pray. No, 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 he's not bluffing. Sure, hope you know what you're doing. Holy shit! I don't have the faintest idea. No, no, it's not. But I, oh no, there's a train thing right there. Now it's the end of the road, mate. But if any, but if but if I remember anything, it was when they were talking about potentially like movie or something. It was. Jesus, this sounds really loud. But I've already put this down, man. Just trying to set things right. And maybe save the world? <laughs> Sounds cinematic with this music. I mean, that's not what I remember, but Jesus. What do we have here? I remember like a clip, it was like hanging off something and he had to climb up the train or something? It's so like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, now it's really low. At least this guy could have done his balance the audio. Let not the world deceive thee with its beauty. It is the dream of a dream. Oh, it's cool that they kind of just. It always it feels a little bit the same, but the settings change just enough to make it fresh. But it is pretty much Indiana Jones meets the mummy meets I don't know it kind of looks oh she's back yay Ooh, that looks she looks familiar like to an actress like the face model you know you insult me. You're a pirate. <laughs> Sully, you could use these constellations to find the lost city. Quickly through the canyon. Or yeah, this should be a night. This should be a, a movie franchise. I don't know what the hell they're waiting on. It feels like the mummy could have been this. Marlo has nothing. Just could leave it alone, could you? Like he looks a little sloppier than anything, anything near like a, a, a born, you know. But it's almost like if you match those two, kind of movie. Ow! Admit it, you love all this as much as I do. No, that's that voice does also sound familiar to me. I probably knew it at one point, and now I just. I change now. Yalla! 2011 still looks aged. It does. It does. Oh, it's okay, but it does. Like this comp Yeah, but look at all of the stuff they're trying there with all the particle effect. Like, they're trying a lot. They're doing a lot. But I think it's just they. I would say it's because they came out so back to back that I think that's why I, they didn't really see. All this, there's a bit of a jump here, but this is like a. This is a five-year jump. And of course, I mean, it's 2016 at this point. This, they likely did Last of Us. They learned stuff there, brought it into this. And now we're in a different setting again, and it just feels... Yeah, right away, it looks like a... Last I checked, we're all a bunch of thieves. Jesus. Quality right up. I'm a man of fortune. And I must seek my fortune. God, this one so, sold so many copies. This is crazy. Are you ready to seek your fortune? Hang on, Nathan! Where is the artifact? I made Jeez. a promise that I was done with this life. How long have you been chasing this thing? Long time. Real long time. I saw one trailer where they were on the cut. I think that was his partner, right? 
they're playing Crash. That was a great clip. Was that at E3? What did I see that? I don't know where I saw that. Someone said that to me. Look, Nate, I'm going to make you a one-time offer. Drop everything. Go home. Yeah, it was a whatever would happen. That's it. Live your life. That was probably important. Or we can just end it right here. The little things. There's got to be another way. I need you on this one. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what they're waiting for, man. This needs to be a movie IP, man. Different choices, how we might have ended up. No, there's not cho That doesn't. That's not I a like thing in this. We've been dealt. What? Is that a thing in this game? <laughs> Is choice? I didn't think that was a thing. No, it's not. Is it like choices you make? No, probably in four choices you make in four, not through the whole franchise. Like that doesn't really happen, right? With PlayStation games, because like how do they? Well, I guess you kind of are online, especially if you play. No, 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 no. These games don't have no choice engine. That's not how these work. <laughs> That's going to come to the channel at some point. Uh, I don't think these games are very long. I know the person that was wa that the person I was watching play. They go with something with a train over a cliff though, and there was some quick time event there, and there was some wall climbing, or it looked like the first one, it like the more greeny. So maybe I saw him playing both, but those uh, those weren't long games, as far as I know. He quit. He he completed those with within like a weekend. He was a grinder though. So just like The Last of Us, this one will end up in 2020 on this channel as well. Uh, I'm just watching some trailers for, I'm going to watch trailers for all of the games that uh, were sent so that I kind of know what's coming up and just so I can start thinking about how to order them because I don't know the dates that they were released and stuff like that. So I'm looking that stuff up, um, seeing the quality. This I will talk about this a little bit. It's like seeing something from 2007, like the first game here, even the 2009 game. That's where I go. This is why I have this thing called a chronology playlist. I'm trying to honor that as much as possible because I feel like there's certain points uh, like I would get to and then going back to play something like Nathan, Dr what was it called? And it was the first one, uh, Uncharted, just the one, whatever that one was called. Uh, those graphics, I feel like they get harder and harder to just... I know the story is probably great. The gameplay is probably great. But do you know what I'm saying? It's like if I'm going to say, am I going to spend 30 hours in a game like this when I could spend 30 hours in Last of Us 2 or... You know what I'm saying? Like I, I would start to weigh things like that and go, I don't think I want to go and do those ones. And then I feel like that's... I'm a completist at heart. I want to kind of see the, the entire progression, especially if that narrative actually floats through all the different versions of the games i feel like i need to play all of them so i can have the context of the entire franchise i know you don't need to do that but i would feel like i'm missing out but at the same time i feel like i'm really struggling to get through some of these older games that said correct me if i'm wrong but 2007 was assassin's creed 1 and that one really held up like there was some moments of course that didn't but my god they, they pulled some stuff off with assassin's creed that was pretty spectacular um just game mechanics wise it was frustrating but it was well done um those two things can't be separate <laughs> but still i can still appreciate the parts that were good um so there could be moments like that too in Nathan Drake. It feels like this traversal stuff was a thing for, I think all of the games have some sort of traversal mechanic and I love traversal mechanics. So uh, maybe it'll, it'll, it'll be fine to play. But then that said, I do need to put these games on the chronology list and then go down the list. So if I'm saying anything in these videos that reminds you of other games that I never talked about maybe i'm not aware of them uh you want me to watch the trailers you want me to you know consider them for the list then by all means add them in the comments below uh we'll continue to talk about these games uh you know through other comments and stuff like that update videos other trailers uh we'll, we'll continue to talk about things here and there so that you have an idea of what's planned for the channel i just don't know when uh and i i keep it fresh so that i'm always aware of the things that i want to try to prioritize through uh so yeah that said i that's it for this one as well i will catch you in the next video don't forget to explore engage and inspire buddy peace